Junior, it is done. Hey, what, mother? I spoke to your father, and it is done. I will start to attend all the meetings by Msomesa Joshua. Ha, goodness me. Did father approve this? Yes. Uh -uh. Do you want to bring us a week of non-stop berating and uh, constant reminders of our ancestral lineage in Bana farming? Mm -mm. That is not going to happen. Your father approves of it. Ha, what? Mother. Did you bewitch him? No, Junior. Technically, he approved of it. Mm. But we are not going to tell him I am attending Msomesa Joshua's meetings. Hey. I told him I found a powerful witch doctor to help us with our banana plantation yields. Her mother, are you crazy? Oh, well, maybe, but for a good reason. And you must retaliate the same if he asks you. Uh, but mother... Look, uh, son. Look, your father is bent on only receiving advice from witch doctors and his ancestors. Hmm? I am giving him his imaginary witch doctor and trying out new approaches to farming. Mm. Mother, you're a genius, I can see. <laughs> but this lie, ha -ha, what if he catches you? Hmm? Thank God me, I'll be back to school next week and, and I don't have to deal with your drama. Well, that is why it must work. Okay? Once the yields improve, mm. your father will not question. See how these poor yields have crippled us financially this mm. year. Mm? Mm. I don't want a repeat of the same. Other people's gardens are thriving. Ours are dying badly. I don't want to break my back for nothing. <laughs> I hear you, mother. Hope you can keep this raid going to a successful end. Now let the games begin. You will attend this week for me and take notes, okay? I have to go and corroborate my story with Anastasia in case your father asks. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I will. Uh, just this was mother. Because, hmm? man, I see trouble coming. <laughs> you returned late last evening. We didn't get to talk. With your father within earshot, I couldn't ask. So, how did it go? Where is the money? Hmm. No one was willing to buy it, mommy. Everyone said it was too old. I tried, mother. Don't worry about it. There is some bananas we have for today. I will sort out tomorrow. Mother, we need to ask for help. We cannot continue like this. The little ones are starting to notice. Yesterday, Rasa was asking why we did not have lunch, and now today... Ruth, what is the rule in this household? We never beg, okay? Things will turn around, my child. You will see. When will things turn around? When we have starved today? No, soon. Very soon. But mother... Ruth, enough, Ruth. No begging. What will people think of us? That we came from the city and now we have become beggars? I won't allow that. Things will turn around. Now go peel the bananas. Ah, mother. Let me show you what they have taught us. Hey! Uh, Mr. Joshua was talking like he was in our garden. Can mm -hmm. you believe all these problems we are having with, the, with these uh, pests and diseases can be managed? Wait. Wait. Let me get my paper so I know what to tell your father in case he asks about the advice from the witch doctor. Hey! Mm. Uh, mm, now, start. <coughs> First thing about managing and controlling pests and diseases is to care for your plantation. Yes, I know that. Hey, but I'm teaching you. Just listen like a good student, okay? Okay, okay, go. Mm -hmm. Did you know that diseases and pests reduce productivity and yields? <laughs> do I respond or do I listen? <laughs> Mother, you're very funny. <laughs> uh, so, diseases and pests can affect banana farming significantly. 
Like those with uh, Yes, like those weavers. Mm. Musome said Joshua said we need to first destroy all the bleeding grounds of the weavers. Mm-hmm. Y- you see, the weavers lay eggs that turn into lava inside the banana stem. Mm-hmm. Eh, this lava cause a very big problem to the banana plant. First, they suck out all the nutrients from the plant. Mm. So the plant does not feed well. What happens next? Are you asking me? Yes, mother. <laughs> you are the student. It dies? I- yes, true. <laughs> True mother, the bananas will start to wilt, snap, and eventually die. Uh, come, let me show you the wilted ones and those that have snapped. Uh, these ones are wilted. Mm-hmm. Uh, you remember last year, mother, um, you were saying it was the sun, and father was saying it was the mchivis? Mm-hmm. It, it is the weevil lover. You see how the snapped ones look like? Hey. Hmm? Like someone cut them with a panga? I swear I could concur with your father that someone actually came to our garden and chopped off our banana heads. No mother, it is actually the pests that are doing this. Good God. But your father and I have been mixing ash, urines, tobacco, marijuana, cow dung, neem and pepper to try and kill these banana weevils for years. Musome Joshua said that the mixture can help because it irritates the weevils. But does not necessarily eliminate them. He, he also said this mixture is actually a good fertilizer and can help the plant grow more vigorously. What do we do about these pests? The first thing is to plant the clean suckers. Um, you see that land in the backyard that father talked about? Uh, we must only plant their clean suckers with no pests. A sucker which is infected will not mature to adulthood. Hmm? If it does, its yields will not be very good. Hmm. We can get clean suckers from Constancy and Tendo. They won't refuse to give me. Their first banana suckers came from our gardens. True. Uh, in this part of our garden, where the weevils have already affected the banana plantation, hmm? so Mr. Joshua says we need to destroy the breeding grounds for the weevils. Mm-hmm. He says, weevils feed, breed, and multiply in after harvest stems and combs, such rotting combs and uh, pseudo stems must be destroyed. Uh, mother, pass me the panga. Why? Mother, just pass me the panga. Hmm? I want to show you something. Musome said Joshua said we can be able to trap and destroy weavers. Hmm? Weavers can be trapped using the pieces of the pseudo stems obtained from harvested pseudo stems. Cut. 10 to 15 centimeters long. And place at the base eh, of the banana plants. Hmm? A recapture is done three days and later killed or destroyed. The captured weevils should never be di- disposed by merely throwing away eh? because they will remain alive and continue to cause havoc. Huh? Hey, um, then there is something called nematode. Uh, hey, you said nematode. Nematode. Now, Come, I show you bananas that are affected by nematodes. You see, they suck the banana roots, causing the banana plant to collapse and get uprooted from the ground. My son, hmm? you learned all this at one meeting. Hey, yes, mother. <laughs> ah! You're going to be a brilliant professor someday. A doctor of bananas, I can see. <laughs> now, the biggest hurdle is your father. I need to cook up something convincing for him. <laughs> your problem, mother. You should have told him the truth. I said trouble. Thank God me I'll be away. Mm-mm. Sometimes the truth is overrated. Hmm? This will be my truth for now until things turn around for us. I can promise you there will be no trouble. I am going to miss you when you return to school. Truly miss you, my son. Yeah. <laughs> so you're going to help me write all the things that you've told me today down so that I do not miss my words while talking to your father. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Mm. 
<laughs> How are you, mother? Ah, mother, what is wrong with you? Have you moved your house to the plantation? No, my dear. Why didn't you call to let me know you are coming? Oh, mother. You're my mother. I can see you anytime I want. I'm just from the house and it is locked. I brought you a few things from town. Oh. What are you doing in the garden on a Sunday? Let's go home. Vera, I think someone is stealing our bananas. Ah, that is not possible. We haven't had any instances of theft since Samuili left. Look at this banana, Vera. Mm, I can't see. This one is a sneaky thief. They have messed with the wrong plantation. Stop it with the threats, Vera. I don't want you involved. I will ask around myself. Hmm? Ask around, mother. I'm going to waylay this thief myself. And I can promise you I will catch them, him or her. No, 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 no. I don't want you involved. But mother, you know me. You know when I have put my mind mm. to something, mm. I will do it whether you like it or not. As long as it is the right thing to do. You are an adult now, and I do not want to deal with the chaos of your hmm. teenage days where you made me apologize to every household for your threatening ways. Ah, mother, everyone used to bully me for my height and size as a teenager. I had to threaten them. Those days are over. Your bullies cannot compare to how good you have turned out. Hmm? But for this one, you will not interfere, okay? Vera, I said you will not interfere. I will think about it, mother. Sometimes I wonder where I inherited this stubbornness from. <laughs> <laughs> from you, mother. Where else? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go home. Okay, let me help you. Thank you. Jenzi, the shock to my body, the 